Hello friends, today we will see first type of branching statement that is simple if. Using simple if, we can write the condition in our program and we will be having some code to execute only if given condition is true and nothing to do if condition is false. Here you can see the syntax of if statement. Here we have used if followed by opening and closing round bracket inside that condition and again it is followed by opening and closing curly bracket. So this opening and closing curly bracket indicates the scope of this if condition. So if this condition is true, we are going to execute the statements which is written inside this true block. You can see here we have provided only true block, not false because this is one way branching. It gives way or option only for true block. Here you can see the example which is to display number if it is positive. So here we will read one number. Here one condition is written that is n is greater than 0. If this condition is true then we are going to display that number. If that condition is false then we will simply exit from that control and we will end the program. So here clearly you can see we have option or statements to execute only if given condition is true and there is nothing to do if that condition is false. That's why this is called as a simple if statements. Now we will see how to write a C program to display if number is even using code blocks. So here I have created one file and stored it using .c. So we will start writing C program. So as per our structure of C program, first line indicates the documentation section, which is nothing but providing an information about the program. So here I will write the title of the program. So display number if it is even. Next section is linking section. So as we are going to use scanf and printf functions in our program to read the values and to display the values on the console. So it is mandatory to include in our program. The next is main function. So integer main and then opening and closing bracket that is the beginning of main function. So to implement this program we required one input number that is of type integer. So I am declaring here one variable number of type integer. Then I will display one message using printf statement that is enter number. Then I will read the number from user using scanf statement. So here percent which indicates we want to read integer number because percent is a format specifier for integer. Now we have one number that is stored in variable number. So we will write one condition here if number is greater than 0 as we are going to use simple if we have to provide option only for true. So I will write a message here printf number is percent d comma number. So I will save this program and I will build and run this program. So it gives you output window that is entered number. So I am giving number 10. So as number is positive, that number will get displayed. Now we will repeat this execution and we will enter some negative number. Let's say it is minus 20 and it doesn't display that message because we have written this true block only if given condition is true. So that will execute only if that number is positive. Thank you.